one way we do this is we take people who are totally deaf, they can't hear anything, and we translate sound into patterns of vibration on a vest. And what happens is the person comes to be able to understand the sounds of the world by the feeling on their torso. David is a participant that we've brought in to help us experiment with the vest. So here's what we're going to do, David. I'm going to write two words on the table, and then after I give you some practice on how they feel, I'm going to present a word and you tell which word you're feeling. Sun, sun, moon, moon. Okay, sun, okay, good. Moon, moon, good, good. You have 32 motors, and these are just like the motors in your cell phone. They bzz, and turn that into patterns on the skin. And the idea is the brain just figures out what to do with it. Sun, good, okay. Now, that's a really clear thing to do because there are 53 million deaf people. But what is really interesting to us is this vest gives us humans hope to experience new senses not only in our lifetime, but in the next year or two. We spend much of our lives now just looking at screens. So we thought, what if we could take any kind of data stream we want and feed it into our brains this way? For example, Twitter, stock market, weather data, Mother Nature gave us particular gifts with our senses on her kind of time scale, but we've now reached a point where we could have other senses that evolutionarily would take a very long time to develop. We work here, we pay taxes here, we go to school here, we contribute to this country, and we are what makes this country great. Thank you for having me here.